Okay, so I decided to do a Fallout 76 video and how to get some material pretty quick. Seen some other videos. They seem like a pain. I don't know if someone's already done a video on this way. <clears throat> maybe they have, maybe they haven't. I would not know. So yeah, if you've already seen this before, or this method before, well, I'm sorry. But yeah, that's life. So uh, let's uh, get into it. Now the first thing you want to do is open your map. You want to scroll over here to the Charlton Landfill. If you have the medical center next to it, you can just fast travel there. If you don't, you can get there however you want. But this is how I get there. Now once you load up, whenever that may be, you want to walk on over here. And right over this hill, you should see the landfill. And all of its uh, junk glory. There's three junk piles and uh, one deposit. I think there's only one, I don't know. Might be more. It's a copper deposit, so if you need copper, there you go. So here's the first one, just get all that. Then head on over here to the second one, which is behind this like house trailer thing. And there is usually enemies here, so be aware of that. They're all super weak though, so you should be no problem taking them out. And then right here is the third one. And now we'll just go to my camp to scrap it. So right here you can see this is all the stuff I got on just one run. Steel, plastic rubber, screws, circuitry. So you get some decent stuff per run. And now we'll just uh, server hop and do another run so you guys can see what else I get. Now again you just want to wait. So you load up again and just like before you just want to make your way this way right on over here and like before there is the landfill with all its junk glory so again the first one go over here to the side there's the second one, and obviously you don't have to do it in this order. You can do it in any order you want. You know, you do you. Then right over here is the third one. And again, we'll just go back to my camp real quick and uh, scrap all that stuff. And yes, I know, I look amazing in this picture. It's fantastic. Now, first of all, excuse this failed jump. And if you're wondering how I can jump so high, I have a mutation. Now again, just scrap it all. And there you go. See, steel, spring, screws, rubbers, yada, yada, yada. So you get some good stuff per run. Sometimes when you server hop, someone will uh, own the landfill or whatever. And they put a couple extractors. People usually don't lock them because I think they don't know how or don't know you can so if you want to be a panana you can jack their stuff and if they've been here for a while like when they're like max full you get a lot of good stuff but again that's up to you if you choose to take their stuff I personally I obviously do it I am uh, not responsible if the owner finds you and he decides to defend his stuff As you see right here, this one's locked. You can pick lock it, but you'll get a bounty. So I wouldn't suggest it. So there's no fun in that. You know, it's never fun getting a bounty. But again, that's up to you. You can see right here, got some stuff. If that was full, probably would've got like 10 screws or something out of that. So yeah, again, it's up to you if you want to attack, uh, take their stuff. And then sometimes, the people do know they can lock their stuff, so obviously they do because the people like me show up and want to take their stuff. See? Locked, locked. They didn't put one back here. People usually do. They don't have to, so yeah, it's not there. Locked. Again, you can pick lock, but you'll get a bounty, so that's up to you. 
locked, but I always check everything because sometimes they forget. For example, I got five purified water because they forgot to lock that one or they didn't care. But that's, uh, that's pretty much it. Hopefully this video is better than my other guide videos, I guess. So hopefully this isn't as bad. You know, leave your feedback. But yeah, that's pretty much it. So, subscribe. And, peace.